Let's talk about this. This is where I'm standing. Alright, so this is uh, flexed. The waist is at 34 and a half. I'm not mad. Little confused, but um, I think I know what's going on. So I'll explain that in a second. I'm gonna go get my coffee. This is where we're at. As you can see, the body uh, has changed. So I'll see if I get um, I'll put these side by side from day one to now. Uh, or of a picture or video. Um, so this is where we're at. Okay. So obviously still got, you know, still got some work to do. But for seven days, not too bad. I tend to hold most of my fat back here. Um, my, I can see my back is not tanned. <laughs> but besides that. Um, you can see that uh, there's much more mus that muscle definition there. Um, still holding on to some here, but compared again to week one or day one, um, sorry, day one, um, it's a big difference. So let's go get some coffee and we'll talk about this more. All right, so I got the slow cooker chicken going. That's gonna be a couple of hours. Make sure to go check out that video if you haven't already. Gonna sip on this and we work out. We're gonna dominate half of this. Probably like half potato salad and the uh, and hot dog or the burger. I haven't decided yet. Alright guys, here it is, so here's the final plate, so the chili dog, um, egg salad, and then I just added some veggies on the side, uh, and the reason for that being is because I know this alone isn't going to fill me up, so this is going to hold me off for my pre-workout meal, I'm going to sip on a uh, Diet Coke, a bootleg Coke Zero in the meantime, and get ready for the gym, I'll take you guys in there with me. All right, we're gonna go with one on the work on the way pre-workout, one after. Uh, I'm just using this pre-workout for now. Nothing special, it's just that that Walmart brand. Um, but it does the trick. It has probably just like minimal beta alanine and um, a little bit of creatine in there. But I get enough creatine throughout the day as it is. So and a little bit of arginine. So. Nice, get get a little, blah, blah, I'm tired. Get a nice little pump from it. Um, gonna take probably like half a scoop right now, and then I'm gonna probably put a scoop in this bad boy. And that's it. I'll see you guys inside. Okay guys, so as you saw, the weight went up and uh, I just wanted to briefly discuss uh, my opinion on why the weight went up. Uh, from yesterday, I believe I was at around 196 and uh, this particular day, 197.2. Uh, first of all, I did not get enough water in the previous day. Um, so my body was probably holding on to some water 
Um, but, you know, that's not a big difference. As you guys saw and could see the pictures side by side, there is a pretty significant difference for just seven days worth of work. Um, and that's why, as I've mentioned in the previous videos, guys, you cannot, uh, you cannot gauge everything on just the number on the scale. So many people get obsessed by just this, this number and uh, forget, you know, what they look like from day to day can, uh, is the biggest reason why we do this in the first place, not necessarily to drop a number. Uh, so when your weight fluctuates, it could be due to anything. It could be due to water weight. You had too much sodium the previous day. Well, too many factors, guys, to just base your uh, progress off of just a number on a scale. Now, don't get carried away and uh, start fooling yourself and saying, oh, it's just a number on a scale if you're going up, you know, three pounds a week. So let's not fool ourselves here. Uh, but just know that that's not the only forms and means of measurement. Let me know down below in the comments, guys, if this has affected you in the past. I know it has for me. Uh, even as a uh, seasoned lifter, it could really affect you if the weight uh, fluctuates like a pound or two from day to day. Don't forget, guys, I got some new programs out. Um, that's going to work for men and women. So for men, I have a six-week fat furnace program, uh, and that's based on a three-day split. It's a push-pull leg split. And then I have a 28-day beach body program uh, for those that want to uh, accelerate their fat loss and just uh, get a good kickstart in the right direction. Uh, of course, I have online training as well. And for those of you that don't want any of that, I got you covered too. I got a free program. And all this stuff, all these links are going to be down below in the description. So make sure to check it out. If you don't want to support your boy, that's fine. Go download your free workout program. I got you, fam. Just leave a like. <laughs> that is day eight. You saw some of the workout. Got this one. What is this? A peanut butter, I think. Chocolate peanut butter. Hey, okay, so... Oh. Whatever. It's chocolate peanut butter. You're gonna have to take my word. So um, I'm gonna go grab some more of these on the way home. Then I'm gonna have that burger and the uh, rest of that egg salad. Um, yeah, we're gonna keep this going. I haven't decided if I'm gonna be as aggressive um, with calories, but you know everything's going well, and um, I just want to keep my momentum going. Uh, if I do need to have like another cheat cheat day or cheat meal or whatever. Uh, down the road I will uh, and actually I'm planning on it Thursday already to have it's not even gonna be a, a free meal or a cheat meal all it's gonna be is a um, just a kind of like a Hawaiian barbecue so steak chicken and rice disclaimer guys there's nothing wrong with steak chicken and rice the only reason I'm saying it's gonna be a cheat meal or a free meal is because there's a ton of rice at the place that I'm going to. It's about two cups and uh, obviously a ton of sodium. So that's why it's a free meal or quote unquote cheat meal. So don't get over exaggerated and don't overthink this guys. That is not a cheat meal. Everything's, everything's going good. Got everything planned ahead of time. Um, yeah, we're going to keep this, we're going to keep this train going guys. So, I'll post the pictures. I'll uh, that's it guys. Thanks for following along. Don't forget to like this video. Tell your friends about it. Tell your grandma. And um, probably not going to take you guys through the rest of the day because um, I just don't feel like, like recording. You guys know. This is day eight. Anyways, this is extra. Uh, don't forget to like the video, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.
That's it, man. That's it. That's the way to go out.